Recently, I talked about not having self-pity in Positive Daily Inspiration. It received so much comment that we wanted to do the prayer this entire week on going from self-pity to self-power. I ask you now to join me in prayer. And as you're joining me in prayer, be willing to release your old self and to become a new creation in Christ. All is God. All is love. All is the healing power of God's truth and love here and now and always. My feelings inside of me are God's feelings. They can't be hurt, upset, or disturbed. Thank God I am not sensitive to self-pity, self-depreciation, or selfishness. I am not sensitive to what others think. Spirit is not sensitive but strong and powerful and poised. If God is this way and I am connected and one with God, so am I. I am never alone. I am never forgotten. I am never isolated from God. Friends, relatives, or children can't make me feel sorry for myself. No one can hurt my feelings and no one has ever hurt my feelings. I take on a new spirit, the fortified spirit, a strengthened spirit in Christ. Self-pity is self-impoverishment. It is self-imprisonment. And God does not pity me. God loves me. And therefore, I will not pity myself or another. God establishes in this moment of prayer and holds me steadfast at all times. And times do not disturb me at all. Neither do people or conditions. I am this moment in the name of Jesus Christ, a tower of strength. I am a tower of vitality. I am a tower of confidence. I can never be fooled again by self-mesmerism or feeling sorry for the poor me. I am free. I am liberated from false beliefs. And this lie of limitation, once and for all, sorrow, grieving, brooding, is unwanted, and it becomes unknown in me. Today, I decree through the power of God that I love the whole world and the whole world loves me. Richly, grandly, joyously, I walk in the wonder and beauty of God's glory. And there is no self-pity. Dear God, I am deeply grateful for this, and I feel this. I feel it from the inside of me, working from center to circumference in mind and body and soul, missing nothing. In Jesus Christ's name, I pray. Amen.